A parade All-American high school football player, Rockwall Heath's Kendall Lawrence was among the most highly regarded running back prospects in the country. Rivals.com listed him as the number 16 running back in the nation, as well as the number 49 overall player in the state of Texas. Because of his exciting running style and charming personality, Kendall became known in the Rockwall community as Showtime. He was an extremely talented young man. Uh, physically gifted as far as his balance and his footwork and his speed, but also you've got to have great work habits to be at the level he was. I, I don't think you can, you can say talent alone, but at the same time a kid just can't work his way into being the kind of player Kendall was. Kendall was special. Earning the starting nod his junior year at Heath, Kendall had 1,734 rushing yards and 25 touchdowns and was named to the second team All-State and first team all district teams for the season. Head coach Mickey Moss was hired in February 2008 and soon realized Kendall was no ordinary running back. I heard about Kendall, incredible talent, and I saw this young man with braided hair <laughs> and a smile on his face and and so you know I, I didn't want to judge him. I said, okay, I'm, but you're thinking this is a pretty good player, I wonder what he's like. And, and the limelight he was in is because he, he was a star as a football player. He was well respected by everyone in the school. But at the same time, he was very humble. Well, it always felt good to know that, that he was on our campus. Uh, you knew it was going to help us on Friday night. But, uh, you know, we, we talked to the kids about what we need from them in the schools. And, and he delivered on all of that as well, too. He didn't deliver just on the football field. He delivered in, in the halls of the school. And um, so that makes it a joy to come to work when, when, when kids are doing those kinds of things and helping. Kendall won first team All-State and District Offensive MVP honors in 2008 as he rushed for 2,681 yards and a whopping 43 touchdowns. He helped lead his team to a 13 to one record and the school's first ever district championship. Rockwall Heath High School held a 13 and 0 record in games in which Kendall played. He had an amazing three game stretch in November of 08, running for yardage totals of 365, 242 and 261 yards in consecutive games while scoring five touchdowns in each of those games. Really, everyone came to find out how great he was against Highland Park. Uh, we're both undefeated, uh, last game of the season on his senior year in the regular season, and we're going to that game. It's for the district championship, and Kendall pulled out an incredible performance. I believe he had around 380 yards on 30-something carries. Uh, at one point, he carried about five guys into the end zone on his back, just showing the great determination on him and, and going into overtime. That game went into overtime, and Kendall got the winning score in overtime on a great play. And just everyone realizes how good this young man was as an athlete and as a player. But what most people didn't see again was just his work ethic, uh, how good a young man he was, how considerate he was of others. He was a very hardworking guy. Um, a great guy, you know. The the he was a friend to all. Um, really, truly, you know. Especially since there are so many people who wanted to be friends with Showtime, um, you know. It it was it was probably tough for him, but I mean, he you know he he was he was friend to anyone who said hey to him. He didn't walk around like here's a kid that rushes for two hundred two thousand yards and an incredible talent. So it, again, Kendall just made it easy for you to feel comfortable being around him. Kendall was and is the, the kind of guy that you, you, you hope your own son's going to grow up to be. 
Complimenting his remarkable talent on the football field, Kendall possessed a work ethic that made him a coach's dream. He arrived early to practice, stayed late, and was a total team player. Took to coaching uh, great. He was very intent on listening and trying to do exactly what we wanted. Going into your senior year and to accept a whole new football staff coming in and changes coming in, I know he had questions in his mind. But Kendall was a, a, an absolute team player and uh, just a joy to be around on a daily basis. He, you know, he had all that talent and there are so many kids that um, you know have some kind of a talent like that you know especially in sports and football I mean this is Texas you know um, that it's real easy for that to kind of get to a kid's head and all these people wanting to you know to know you and and to, to be around you you know can can probably be tough for you know a teenager to handle in spite of his superstar football status Kendall maintained a humble and giving spirit he used his celebrity status to mentor younger students, speaking throughout the district on the benefits of staying in school and focusing on academics. Hard working a student as he was on, on the football field, he, he took the academic uh, piece of things seriously and that was one of the things he talked to the kids about. He, you know, that he, he's not gonna, he knew he wasn't going to get to the next level unless the grades were there. Um, and, uh, and he knew that his football career wasn't going to last forever. And so he would talk to the kids about those same things. Now, right now, his football career is still going, you know, and, and, um, but, but that, that he is such a well-rounded human being like that, that, that he can go and speak to kids and tell them to stay in school, that it means something, and, you know, overcome challenges in school. I that, mean, that, that's, that's great stuff there. Never forgetting his roots, Kendall has stayed close to the Rockwall community. He comes back to Heath quite a bit, and I know he's in contact with the coaching staff. I know he reaches out to them, you know, on Friday nights and says, you know, hey, coach, tell him I'm rooting for him, you know. And because people still know who Kendall is, um, you know, that, that means a lot. Every Friday night, he'd send me a text, hey, coach, tell the boys to play hard and tell them I'm rooting for him. And, and then after the game, he had sent a congratulations. He kept up with his. He kept up with the players, not just the first year he was out, but every year, even even this year, uh, going into this our first game on Friday night, he said, "Hey, coach, who are you playing? We'll tell the boys to turn it up." <laughs> I remember he he blew me away one year when out of the blue on Father's Day, you know, I got a text that said, "You know, Happy Father's Day." I you know just it knocked me over that. Um, with everything he's got going on and all the success that he's having, he still thinks of us. Following high school, Kendall went on to attend the University of Missouri as a late recruit. In 2013, he attended summer training with the Dallas Cowboys and is currently playing for the Hamilton Tiger Cats in the Canadian Football League. He's got a lot of great qualities and ingredients about him. Um, he, he has the power to influence and impact people. Uh, you love being around this young man, but at the same time, his work ethic, I know that he continues to strive and, and persevere. Uh, he's gonna be successful and even beyond football. More than simply another high school football star, Kendall Showtime Lawrence has left behind him a legacy. His incredible football talent, positive attitude, and caring personality have left an indelible mark on the Rockwall community. We're proud of him, that I'm proud of him, um, that he's, he's, he's done good and he's still touching lives and, and to that I say to Kendall, thank you. In describing Kendall, um, best I can, I would say an incredible talent. Humble, kind, gentle, hardworking, but in the Rockwall Heath community when you mention one word, showtime, that's Kendall.